Okay, hello. This is Rani Ahmed with you. This is lesson 9 in uh, how to use uh, IRC and chatting using the IRC protocol. Uh, well, in uh, this lesson, I'm uh, going to tell you uh, about uh, what are uh, what we call bots. Okay, it's written like this. Okay, what are the bots? And uh, what are uh, what is the next serve and what's the chance serve and uh, how uh, can we protect our a uh, username and how or the nickname or the you know the name that I log in with uh, into an IRC server, okay? And uh, how to keep it uh, on uh, to ourselves, okay? So first of all, the bots. And the next serve and the chance serve. Okay, now uh, the a bot is like uh, it's like a, it's a, like a representation of a person, but it's not really a person. It's a, a software that acts as a true person. It's like a, a bot is like uh, is the short uh, name for robots. So uh, the bots are uh, just like uh, used to uh, do things like uh, monitoring uh, people because they are uh, faster when managing uh, the uh, channel maybe for uh, doing harmful things like flooding the channel with uh, so many messages or a repetition in the channel uh, sending so many repeated uh, messages in the channel maybe also uh, like some uh, obscene or uh, offensive words might, might pass so uh, you can uh, ban that user or kick that user this is all the banning and uh, uh, kicking of users out of your channel of the channel that you run this we will get to it later but uh, just understand that uh, this is uh, used I mean the bot to for uh, monitoring most of the time and maybe you can use the bot to, to uh, query uh, like uh, help messages and things like that for you from uh, the uh, server okay or from its database if there is a database connected to it so uh, now next we move to what we call next serve and chance serve uh, Nick serve uh, is a bot and chance serve is a bot too but uh, well uh, the next serve and the chance serve uh, they like if you want to manage uh, a channel okay uh, they are the only one who uh, can uh, like uh, save all the data related to channel management because once you enter a, ch a new channel Okay, you are the owner of this uh, channel now and you can be the administrator or the uh, operator as we say uh, of that uh, channel so uh, what I want to reach with you is that uh, like the management okay of all of this okay is uh, say uh, like if you want to try to get into the channel management thing uh, it won't like be saved forever once you leave the channel once everybody leaves the channel okay uh, the channel will be free uh, free of all uh, banning uh, like all the uh, rules and uh, that would be ban bad people and things like that okay so you need something or some uh, way to keep all uh, those rules and the and who can get in and who can get out from a channel and what are the passwords used to uh, to get into a channel and things li like that so all management stuff is saved in, uh, inside the uh, database that's run by the bot here called chance serve because it's the channel uh, server okay now the next serve is the one who's responsible for registering uh, nicknames, uh, taking care of nick uh, nicknames, and not to forget also I, asked, I should have told you that there is another one called memo memo serve which is uh, support uh, supposed to uh, 
be like an email okay for uh, like an internal email just on the server okay not outside the server it won't send emails out to the outside to people outside the server just to people who are registered using nextserve okay and are listed inside nextserve's uh, information and uh, memo serve can uh, can allow those people uh, who are absent from the server and not logged in and not uh, currently uh, appearing on the server okay to be, uh, like to be sent messages when they are uh, away from the uh, from their from the server or not logged in okay so uh, that's next serve that's chance serve and that's memo serve now um, well, uh, the uh, next serve uh, is what we're going to start with. Uh, and we're going to show you uh, how to get uh, next serve uh, help. Next serve is used mainly at Dalnet and uh, uh, Freenode, and I think under now they, uh, they use it. Now, uh, we start with the following. Now, because I don't memorize the whole uh, set of commands, I always use the help. Okay. So, what I do, because different servers has, have different uh, ways of accessing the commands, the, like the commands that you send to next server, because next server, as I told you, is a bot. It's like as if it acts as a true person, so therefore, uh, it will help so therefore there are uh, subcommands uh, that you send them to Nextserve so it can do uh, what you want now uh, the, to start with first of all you can do either uh, ways of commands you can uh, like send a private message this is another way of sending a private message so you can say slash, slash msg uh, Nick, if I want to send to Nick serve, if I want to send to anybody, just as MSG, Nick, this is a private message. It won't be shown to anybody, and you don't have to see a new dialog box uh, going on. So slash Nick serve, uh, okay, and I type help, okay, and if you want to help, for example, on a command also like not just list the all commands you want help on one of the commands so you type the command here for example I have flags uh, yeah or maybe uh, uh, property we'll get to that and it will uh, tell you how to uh, use the property uh, for example here we're going to go with register okay and um, of course this is just for explanation and making things uh, clearer on a bigger font okay it's not uh, where we write things we write things all the time in the chan in the chan like in the uh, you know the typing here okay so um, so let's see the help so I type slash msg next serve And I type help. Cool. So I got all those in uh, bold black. Okay, those are commands, and there are also other commands here. Now, um, now another way to access NextServe and send commands to NextServe is this way. There's a shorthand for slash msg NextServe, which is slash uh, ns. Okay. And for uh, the uh, chance of slash CS, okay, and for the memo serve this MS, okay. So now all I, uh, those I don't want them at this time. Once we finish with the next serve, I'll move to memo serve, then I can move to a uh, chan serve, okay. So NS, and I'll see uh, how to register. So uh, help register just just to tell me how to register okay so if I type 
so if I type slash ns uh, help register okay so this is the syntax this is how you type it so you should type the following you should type the following which is slash ns and like this so I should first of all the current email the current uh, user uh, nickname that I'm online on with like I'm currently on super Linux dash HP if I uh, this is already registered but what I want to say is that you have to pick a, a nickname bef that's not used by anybody and then uh, you can uh, register it okay so start with a nickname then you register it okay and uh, you have to re replace here your own password okay and uh, type also your own email address it has to be a valid email address because what would happen is this is my email if I go back to my email and I search here for free node because I don't want to do it because I had it already so I, I would do this um, free free node okay so let's see okay so this is the next serve okay so you will get such a message as a message, uh, message similar to this on your email and it will have something like this line okay similar to this line so to register the username superbsd for example okay to you have to verify that you own this uh, nickname so uh, you have to use this command okay and copy it then paste it to the channel here sir and uh, you will be uh, verified now uh, how do I use the password because how do I say that this person is really me because why do I register it because I don't want anybody to uh, like uh, act as if he's his I am okay or he's me okay um, so the way is after I verify this then I must use it every time I will go into the server okay um, so the command would be to uh, uh, to identify myself okay so I say slash ns and I identify and then type uh, my nickname for example I type super Linux and then type the password okay this is my password whatever password you have you just type your own password and just send this message to the server and you'll be identified okay now why do I really need as a, a register, a registration other than uh, ident identity theft uh, it is all about uh, also some channels don't allow you to log in to their uh, or uh, to uh, be inside uh, their channels unless you do the following which is being registered okay So I hope you liked this uh, lesson. Okay, we'll proceed with with other commands later. Uh, but it's important to register your nickname so people uh, would know that uh, this this person is really you. Okay. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and use your own real uh, account on Google.
to subscribe so you can follow my uh, new uh, episodes uh, of the lessons. Okay, thanks for watching.